Well then, at this time, it gives me honor and pleasure to introduce to you our Grand Worthy Matron, if you will all please stand. Sister Amelita B. McDowell, Grand Worthy Matron of Ophelia Grand Chapel, or at least the Star Prince of Affiliate for the State of New Jersey. Thank you. You may be seated. The Sister Laquanda Maynard, Mistress of Ceremony, the Right Worshipful of Jeffrey C. Spann, Junior Grand Warden representing the Most Worshipful Ricardo McNeil Grandmaster, to Brother Clifton J. Hardy, Grand Associate Patron representing Brother Andrew Burroughs, Grand Worthy Patron, Grand Chapter Officers, Past and Present, Officers and Members of Star Bethlehem Chapter Number 26, to the honorees and to all assembled. Good evening. Good evening. I bring you greetings from Ozeal Grand Chapter, Order of the Eastern Star, Prince Hall Affiliation for the Jurisdiction of New Jersey. I am delighted to be here, and yes, I am Amelita B. McDowell. You heard my name about 20 times tonight. So this is Amelita B. McDowell. Thank you. I, I always laugh when I say my name because, you know, it, it's unusual. And then I put the B in there, and that really makes me laugh. <laughs> but thank you so much, Star Bethlehem, for um, receiving me so graciously. Thank you for the invitation to your 94th anniversary celebration. Thank you for my lovely corsage and all of the amenities extended to me and my husband. I like that you selected yellow as your color. It's one of my favorite colors. And also it makes you think about spring. So thank you so much for that. I want to congratulate the honorees. Your leadership to the communities is invaluable. The time and effort that you put in for what you do is priceless. So we really appreciate you for that. I also want to congratulate the chapter for selecting Autism Awareness as their charity of the year. You know, this is a great cause, and it was ad admirable that you selected this complex developmental disability to share your charity with this year. So we appreciate you. So let's all give the chapter applause for, for celebrating the leaders of their communities and Autism Awareness. Thank you. At this time, I would like to introduce some grand chapter officers who are here this evening. Would the grand chairpersons and co-chairpersons please stand to be recognized? These are the ladies who work very hard for Ozeal Grand Chapter to make sure that we are functional. We also have some appointed officers, and I'll start with Sister Alabine Goins, who is a grand, on the Grand Secretarial staff. <laughs> Sister Kim Berry, Grand U.S. Flag Bearer. <laughs> Sister Jacqueline Williams, Grand Ada. <laughs> Sister Vaughn Jones, Grand Martha. <laughs> Sister Burma J. Hall, Grand Assistant Marshal in the West. Sister Mary Parham, Grand Assistant Warder. Sister Betty Durrell, Grand Marshal in the West. We also have Sister Sharonda Kai Wise, Administrative Assistant to the Grand Warden Matron. And Sister Serena Johnson, Administrative Assistant to the Grand Worthy Matron. Thank you. Are there any other Grand Chapter officers that I missed? Sister Versi McNeil, Grand Esther, also, keep standing, also she is the First Lady for the state. That means that she's the wife of our Grand Master. Sister Marcella Elmore, who is also Grand Assistant Warder. Thank you. And we have um, the District Deputy Grand Matron for the Sixth Order of the Eastern Star District here. One of Amelita's awesome 18, Sister Nicole E. Ingo Horton. Thank you for all you 
We have elected officers. We have Sister Lillian Hargrove, who's on the Prince Hall Home Board. <laughs> Sister Pearl M. Moore, Prince Hall Home Board. <laughs> and Sister Selena Newton, Prince Hall Home Board Emeritus. <laughs> have I omitted anyone? Who is most worshipful, Harry McDowell, past Grand Master, my husband. Sister Hunter, please come forward. Okay. <laughs> Sister Hunter, thank you so much for all you do for your chapter. You are such a sweet person, we love you, and we appreciate your work. So this is just a little gift from me to you to show my appreciation for all you've done this year. Thank you. Uh, my theme for this administration is preserving the past to embrace the future. My mottos, Presence means purpose, meaning if you're on this side of glory, God still has a purpose for you, and to live well, laugh often, and love much. Live like there's no tomorrow, laugh as long as you breathe, and love as long as you live. Thank you so much.